Welcome back mga kababayan at ngayon ah, tayo ay Minecraft Educational Gaming Grade 6 Science at so subscribe for more videos, share for more comment, comment for more games and like for inspiration news and for gaming. Our topic for today is Earth Slayer. Our extras for today is Earthquake. So what are you waiting for? Let's go out. In grade 3, we learn about these three layers of earth. In grade 3, not in grade 6. This is the topsoil, the subsoil, and the bedrock. As we can see in Minecraft, we have the subsoil is more thicker than topsoil and bedrock. And dito tayo ngayon sa layers of earth ng grade 6. And we have here a crust, a mantle, and between it is a moho discontinuity. This is the outer core, and of course, this is the inner core. We have the crust. The crust, the outermost layer, and the thinnest layer of Earth's little spear. We, um, in here, the Earth is not solid and continuous shell. Crust is divided in, into two parts, continental crust, composed of different, co uh, no, different continents. Okay, this is composed of different continents and consists of gravel. In the oceanic crust... And the oceanic crust composed of different bodies of water and con it consists of basalt. The present continents lie on tectonic plates. Tectonic plates is a massive irregularly shaped slot of rock generally composed of both continental and oceanic lithosphere. These tectonic plates are moving in different directions. The little spear are made of a rigid layer of Earth's crust known as crustal plates. Some plates are large, what we call major. Some plates are small, what we call minor. The major plates are Eurasian plate, Pacific plate, North American plate, Indo-Australian plate, Antarctic and African plate. Uh, minor plates, we have here the Philippine plate, Cocos plate, Nazca plate, and Caribbean plate. Plate boundaries areas when two plates meet. Of course, in here, we have there, we have here a uh, top types of boundaries. First one, we have convergent plate boundaries. Convergent plate boundaries occurs when two tectonic plates collide. And we have here three types of convergent plate boundary. The first one is oceanic to oceanic plate boundary. Oceanic to oceanic plate boundary triggers the formation of change of active volcanoes as magma rises beneath the surface. The second one is continental to continental plate boundary. The continental to continental plate boundary, the denser plate slides over the less dense plate. As a result, land masses are buckled up, forming mountain ranges. Number 3. Oceanic to continental plate boundary. Oceanic to continental plate boundary. Trout was formed when the denser Philippine plate descent under the less dense Pacific plate. Example, Mariana Trench, drop trench in Western Pacific Ocean. And we have here number two, divergent plate um, type of boundary, divergent plate boundary. Divergent plate boundary occurs when two plates move apart from each other. When plates break apart, the little spear thins and ruptures forming fractures on the crust. The fracture became filled with magma, cools off, a new crust is formed between the divergent plate divergent plate. In the oceanic crust, this process is called sea floor spreading. So number three type of boundary is transform fault boundary. Transform fault boundary occurs when two plates slide past one another. Two plates glide each other in different directions. Earthquake occur. 
Example, the, uh, the area in San Andreas Fault between Pacific and North American Plate is an example of transform plate boundary. So, I ask you, what is earthquake? Earthquake is a sudden movement or vibration of Earth's crust, Earth's, of the Earth's rocky outer layer. It is caused by masses that suddenly shift in position the energy stored in the rock. Masses is transmitted onto the surface in the form of the epicenter and the focus. So we have kinds of earthquake. The first kind of earthquake is tectonic earthquake. Tectonic earthquake is the strongest and most devastating. When two plates move suddenly against each other, the earthquake occurs known as tectonic plates. Tectonic plate. Tectonic earth te known as tectonic earthquake pala. Tectonic earthquake occurs along faults. So this is my example of tectonic earthquake which na Yung type niya ng boundary ay transform fault boundary. Earthquake occurs when two tectonic plates slide past to each other. So, example yan. Nagaglide na sila. So, meron yan sa ilalim. At ito ang papakita ko sa inyo. At ito yon This is the focus. Yung sa ilalim. And this is the epicenter. Sa ibabaw. Ganyan. Next na kind of earthquake is volcanic earthquake. Volcanic earthquake occurs in areas associated with volcanic activity. Example, Mount Mayon in Albay, in Philippines. As the fluid rises to the surface, it's, it pressure fracture rock masses and causes continuous tremors that can be felt on small small scale. And here we are, the extra meanings. Of course, that earthquake is extra, but this is the super extra meaning. So, what is magnitude? Magnitude is the energy released by an earthquake. Next, what is intensity? It's the measure of how much damage an earthquake causes on the surface. We scale it or the ano, Mercalli scale. Seismograph. Ayan ang ginagamit sa kapag kung gano kalakas yung magnitude niya. Kung gano siya yung nag nag monitor kung gano kalakas yung magnitude niya ng earthquake. Ang sa small digits naman siya yung nag-aaral ng ng mga magnitude Sila nagagantaren, nagsisismograph, sila yun. So, sana naman ay naintindihan nyo ako. Dahil ang ating next topic is Volcano. Yeah. Our next topic is Volcano. Dangerous effect and helpful effect and good effects pala. Tapos, meron tayong apat na ito, effects of volcanic gases, effects of lava flows, effects of pyrolast, ano, elastic flows, effects of volcanic activities in the global climate. And then, mga gagawin before volcanic eruption, after volcanic eruption, kaya during volcanic eruption. So,
sana talaga guys. Sana, sana lang. Ito na kasi ang aking first time na nagturo ng ganito. Nag-report ng ganito sa Minecraft Packet Edition. Sana po may natutunan kayo. Paalam na po mga kababayan.